Okay, we're here. We're here with uh, Have a Heart, uh, friends of Animal Control Center, and, and Valerie uh, Buckley. Uh, she's got her team members here, Yay. and she's going to share with you um, what what um, her program is all about, and, and how she got involved in it. And those that may want to contribute and be a part of uh, her cause, uh, you know, these, these little puppies. Where puppy go? Puppies right the here. Little puppy. You got to have the little puppy sleeping. This little guy needs a home. He needs a home. So Valerie, why don't you explain uh, sure. to everybody what, uh, how it gets started and what it's all about and so forth. Sure. My name is Valerie Buckley, and in January of this year, I started a program called Have a Heart, Save a Life. It's uh, a volunteer group based at Baldwin County Animal Shelter. And uh, these are some of our volunteers, Ms. Denise Ward, John Tor Tony, and Sandra Dixon, dog trainer. And this is our little guy called... What's his name again? Scrappy Doo. Scrappy Doo. He just came in yesterday. The officers found him, and he's four weeks old. And uh, Miss Dawn has been fostering him. We don't need him in the shelter right now. They're scared of the Jesus out of him. <laughs> but basically, uh, <clears throat> we, our mission is to get these animals out of the shelter, to get them home, to get them adopted. There's no adoption fee. There is a fee, $50 across the board, to get an animal spayed or neutered per the law of Georgia, and Have a Heart will pick up the uh, rest of the fee for the spay and neutering if it costs more than 50. We'll pick that, we'll pick that balance up. But these animals must be spayed and neutered, and they all need a home. There's only five to seven days that these uh, critters uh, are allowed to stay. And we have reduced the euthanasia rate, which used to be actually 30 to 80 Animals a month would go down since January, uh, and now currently up until May, we've saved over 240 animals. Wow! So this, so this little guy right here, he's got five to seven days, and then yes, they're going to. Yes. He would be going even me? the puppy, even the puppy, puppies, yeah. mama cats with their kittens. Um, it's it's sad, but that's what we do. Why do they why do they put them down? There's no room. We aren't, it's a shelter, the officers, the two officers that cover the county and the city constantly are getting calls to pick up animals and what's happening because of the economy, people are turning their own pets in. And unfortunately, the other day, we had a 90 pound uh, female uh, red nose pit lab mix. The folks were moving, couldn't take her with them. We found her a home. She was already spayed, current on shots, but again, she ended up at the shelter. Why should she be put down? Yeah. She was someone's pet. So we're, it's bittersweet. We're catching all the strays, trying to get them a home. They don't deserve to go down. They're adoptable. And we're getting people's pets. And that's really sad. But we work very hard. I showcase, we all showcase animals throughout the week. Ian Poole at Potopia has been very kind. He's allowed us since January to showcase animals. We were showcasing animals every Wednesday and Saturday. This Saturday we'll be at Potopia again uh, to showcase the puppies. Hopefully um, he may get adopted before then. But we have several puppies at the shelter. And also uh, this weekend, uh, Saturday, we're going to be outside Bodyplex and Tractor Supply. There's an uh, area. We'll have two tents set up for the larger dogs. And so they need a home. The larger dogs are a problem because not a lot of people want to get the big dogs. Puppies are cute. So we do all we can to do this. And uh, we've got a lot of support from the community. The Masons have contributed uh, monetary-wise to help us out with the vet bill. Of course, with you folks helping us, Mr. Uh, Heron, with the $500, all this goes to the vet bill because when critters come in, we got to get them fixed. They've got colds or they got the mange. And, you know, I'm not going to let them go down because they're sick. Mm -hmm. Again, my name is Valerie Buckley, and if uh, anyone is interested in volunteering, donating supplies, paper towels, uh, kitty litter, anything, toys, anything for dogs and cats and puppies, uh, we would love, we would love to have you join us. And you can reach me at 478-232-8155. Stop by the shelter. Monday through Saturday, we're there. We man the fort from usually about 9 until about, say, roughly 2. Please come to the shelter. It's not a scary place. We're renovating it. These animals need you. They need a home. And uh, we could use your support. And donations, 
monetary wise, they're always welcome to help pay the vet bill. And we thank you very, very much. And have a heart and save your life. <laughs> All right, that's it. Thank you very much.